welcome back to my channel if you haven't done so already please 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 subscribe and after finished watching this video make sure that you check out some of my older videos on my channel but in today's video i'm going to be doing a what i ate in a day which has been totally requested a lot from you guys as well as if you follow me on instagram i am always showcasing like what i'm eating like on breakfast lunch dinner snacks so a lot of people are always asking like oh my god like how did you make that how did you make that so here it is the most requested video from me um i'm excited about it because i love to cook guys this is like a new fun hobby for me like making new recipes and trying them out and hello fresh has really helped a lot in that area as well i talked a little bit about hello fresh in my last video so make sure to check it out um but i'm also thinking of doing a series so i'm thinking of um doing a cooking series called steph the chef what do y'all think y'all think that's cute i don't know but um <laughs> let's jump into the video so for breakfast guys i prepared a green smoothie so as you guys can see i have all my ingredients here i have some strawberries raspberries um i have a avocado some ginger a green apple a bunch of spinach and a banana and the reason i really love green smoothies is because they are packed with fiber they lower your cholesterol and your glucose levels and they keep you feeling more fuller for a longer period of time throughout the day it's also really good for like a cleansing process as well as just getting all of those you know veggies and fruits into your body that maybe you neglect on some occasions i absolutely absolutely love green smoothies and i'm going to show you guys how i prepare it but I actually wanted to talk to you guys. I know you guys saw me like talking my little self off. So I wasn't actually in a meeting. I was actually um, in a therapy session. So um, I actually started um, therapy. This is my first session. And this is something that I've been wanting to do because um, not because I'm going through something or anything, but I think therapy is also just like it can be for preventative measures it's like it's like the same as you going to the doctor you know to get your annual visit or going to the dentist for your annual cleanings and stuff like that um i think you should do like i'm in the mindset right now where i feel like you should you know take care of your mind as well um from a preventative um standpoint as well because it could be something that you don't even know you're struggling with and then you go through therapy and then you realize like dang i didn't even realize that was affecting me but um, the therapy section was really, really good. Um, I was really nervous um, because I've never done it before, but um, it was really, really good. She made me feel really, really comfortable. 
um and i think i'm gonna continue to keep doing it and um just see how it works um but guys i am hungry so i'm actually gonna go upstairs and change my clothes i'm gonna change to something a little bit more comfortable i'm done with meetings for today and um as you can see i just finished my zoom call with um, my counselor so i'm going to go upstairs to change to something more comfortable um because i did kind of spill something on my shirt um, I spilled a little green smoothie on my shirt. So I'm going to go upstairs, change, and then I'm going to come downstairs and we can get started on lunch. So guys, for lunch, I decided to make a chicken salad. Um, I actually made this chicken last night for another dish and I chopped the rest of it up to put inside my salad today. Not only am I putting chicken in my salad, I'll also be putting cherry tomatoes, some feta cheese, as well as some pralines in it as well. Um, guys, I usually don't like to eat anything super heavy at lunch because I am working and I, I don't want to fall asleep while I'm at the desk trying to pay attention in meetings and things like that. So I just try to keep it light and simple um, and, and also very quick as well because um, I do take like an hour break for lunch. So I like to have as much me time for myself while I'm eating and just relaxing while I'm away from the computer. So when eating lunch, I actually like to remove my computer off of my desk just so I can disconnect from work thoroughly. And I either listen to an audible book or listen to music or catch up on TV shows just so I can thoroughly enjoy my meal. So guys, I do like to incorporate a snack in between my lunch and my dinner. I usually don't like to eat anything heavy or anything like that. So I usually gravitate towards fruit or veggies. And today I actually grabbed a green apple and sliced it up and just sprinkled some ground cinnamon on top of it. Um, it's really, really simple and easy to make and actually really, really quite delicious um, and healthy for you as well. Um, I've been trying to eat more healthy and more cleaner. So eating things like this or carrots and celery with almond butter really are like perfect healthy snacks throughout the day. So guys, for dinner, I decided to make chicken ramen, which is from HelloFresh. Guys, I cannot express how much I absolutely love HelloFresh in the subscription because they give you just enough ingredients for the meal that you're making. Tonight, I am actually making the four servings because I know that I'm going to be wanting to snack on this for a while. And guys, everything will be linked below in the description box.
after eating dinner, I always like to end my night by drinking a cup of hot tea. Tonight, I decided to drink the jasmine green tea infused with fresh mint. I love drinking a hot cup of tea at the end of the night. It just relaxes you and just winds you down for the night. And I love adding fresh mint to my tea because it is rich in nutrients and it is very good for your digestive system. Guys, I would definitely recommend to drink this after having a really heavy meal. I also like to put a little agave nectar into my tea just to give it a little sweetness. And then I like to stir everything together just so everything is infused. And then I'm set for the night. So guys this is where the video concludes i hope you guys found some inspiration on some recipes to incorporate in your everyday life if you guys haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel as well as check out other videos on my channel after this one i will see you guys in my next video bye